What's up guys, Zachary Dalgo9 here, and today I will be making a bigger base in Subnautica. As you saw there, that was just a cinematic. And, uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. Oh, and then the, I guess that purple tablet cost diamonds. Okay, so I've been doing some progress here. And I think it looks pretty good. I have the basic outline for the design done. So it's coming out pretty good, yeah. I'll uh, cut to another part which has some more progress. Alright, so I am almost done with the exterior already, I know. Probably should have put more footage in here, but it got corrupted because my capture card's old. So, uh, heh <laughs> And, um, here's the basic layout, so it's gonna be a nine multipurpose room structure. And, remember these videos take a long time for me to make. So let me make a a like and subscribing would be very helpful. Okay, let's put in these first lockers of my base. My new base. By the way, I destroyed my old one, so uh, no more of that ugly mess. Okay, let's put one here, maybe. Let's put one right there. Yeah, that's pretty good right there. And let's grab another one. I wonder if I don't have titanium. I probably do. Yeah, I probably do. Yeah. Um. I don't. Okay. Well. That sucks. I guess I just put all my stuff in here. No, because I need a lot more titanium. <sighs> Look. This is Altera HQ. This may be our only communications window. Can't send a rescue ship all the way out there, so Aurora, you're just gonna have to meet us halfway. We've uploaded blueprints to the ship's We're doing computer. A sandwich run, you in? Uh, yeah. Give me a second. Black box data shows the high security terminal in the captain's quarters is still functional. Becky's leaving like in five minutes. All right, well, tell Becky I'll just take the the regular. The regular. Yeah, she'll know what I mean. The code should and be. If she doesn't. Just tell her the regular, dude. Okay. The if code. I say regular, and she's like, "What's the regular? I have to come all the way back up here." The code should be two six seven nine. The regular's just a ham and cheese. Okay, would you just say ham and cheese? Ham and cheese! Okay. Alright then. So, uh, I guess we're um, gonna have to go to the Aurora. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. Real fun. Let's get the Seamoth fragment right here. Just like so. Mm hmm, that's good. And, um, yeah. Let's make this mobile vehicle bay, I think. Yeah. But we need this for more stuff. Um, let's go just release it out here. Right on top of my base. Okay, that works right there. I wish I climbed on top, it'd be so cool to flip to the top. Why does this have to be above land? Why can't it be below ground? It'd be much easier. Whatever. Um... Seamoth. Okay, we need some materials. I guess I'll just go grab my materials. Okay, I got those materials. How ironic. Well... Half an hour of work summed up into 10-ish minutes, maybe. I don't know. Seamoth. Got a bit of lag there. Newsflash, I don't care about my endorphin. Oh my gosh. Just burned the robot. <laughs> okay. Excuse me. Yay, you got our first vehicle. Means I can go much farther. Next, it's just gonna be this prawn suit, and I should probably get a moon pool eventually, too. Yeah, that looks good there. I like it there. Yes, yes. Alright, guys, so here's the completed base. Let's go take a peek inside of it. So, here we have our fabricator. On the left, there is our main plants. Here's our decoration plants. And 
back here is our bioreactors. There's one there, there's one there. This will be our future office right here. Here is the storage. That'll be the aquarium over there. And that'll be our bedroom over there. And that is pretty much it for this build. I think this is gonna be a good base for the rest of the time. It took much longer than it looks. Much longer, like, I can't even say how long this took. So, uh, yeah, that's the base. And, uh, yeah, looks pretty good. Alright guys, well that is all for today. Make sure to smash that like button. And, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Also subscribe. And, um, goodbye. Nana.